Well, good afternoon, everybody. Welcome back to Suburban Home Center, Wyoming, Arizona. Hydroponics in the background. I just got back from the library cell. And so I'm putting my video together. And tomorrow I'll have, tomorrow or Saturday, I have a full video on planting fall garlic. But I'll show you a little bit of it. Tuesday night I did a class with the Master Gardeners and it was open to the public and I talked about planting garlic cloves in the fall time. And so that was my display table and then when I got home I took all those garlic cloves apart and they rested on my counter for a couple days and now I am going to disinfect them and then soak them in a liquid fertilizer. All of that will be in the video that comes up I hope by tomorrow. And there are different sizes of garlic bulbs you can buy when you're going to plant. Try to get the largest possible that you can. Now some garlic is not going to be as large as other garlic. And I did show them some soft neck garlic. I cannot plant soft neck garlic in the fall. I can only do that in the springtime. But I'm going to take those packages down and I can do it in Arizona. But the whole process of hard neck and soft neck. We, we're going to talk about that in the video and it is a fabulous plant to, to grow. Now the other thing I had to do out of my gardens was to make some grape juice and I picked the last of my grapes. Now the key to making good grape juice is you need it to be 190 degrees. So I'm using my chef temp um, thermometer and I process it the half gallons for about 20 minutes on my elevation and it makes fabulous grape juice. And if you want a video about that, let me know. Now I'd taken this picture um, when we went over the mountains and it snowed and a friend of mine makes cards and she used it and she gave me some of the cards. Now library books from the book sale. So excited. Now today when I was working the book sale, I found some DVDs on spinning wool silks, um, alpaca, and some of those DVDs had not even been opened. So I'm totally excited about um, expanding my knowledge. This is the painting that Mary and I finished today. And we also started our next one, a bowl of tomato soup and a grilled cheese sandwich. So I'll show you the progress on that. Everybody have a great day. Um, sorry, this video is a little bit shorter and I'm trying very hard to get it up at by five o'clock. So I hope it's very close to that. Everybody have a great week. Um, going to South Dakota this weekend for part of the weekend and seeing some grandbabies. See you later, everyone.